Here with Jacob Nunez, key two-run homer, starting the scoring in Northwestern State's 8-1 win against New Orleans. And Jacob, uh, what, did, what did you see from uh, Chris DeMeo? What was the pitch? Uh, it was a fastball up in the zone. It was, uh, I was looking for a fastball the whole A-B, and he kind of tried to pitch me backwards with some off-speed and couldn't throw it for a strike, so I knew uh, I was going to sit on one pitch, and I got it. How good did that feel? I know uh, it's been kind of a, not really a struggle. You've kind of been in and out of the lineup, so it's probably been tough to establish a rhythm at the plate. How good did it feel to put that really good swing on that one? Uh, it felt really good, actually. It's a pitch I had, I've been seeing lately, and uh, I've just been missing it up in the zone a little bit, and I, I got it again and took a, took advantage of it. Well, you got to watch a lot of good pitches from Nate Jones today. What did you see from him? It looked like uh, after those first couple innings, certainly he really settled in, but had really good stuff all day. Yeah, he was he was uh, throwing pretty hard today. Uh, all all uh, all three of his pitchers or four of his pitchers, I say, were working pretty well. He could kind of throw it wherever he was he was wanting to. You may be part of it. Well, you're part of at least a tied NCAA record. We'll see if it's anything more. But you ever remember having two pick off pick offs in an inning yourself, and let alone uh, being part of three pick offs in an inning? No, actually, I don't. I don't uh, think that's ever happened to me. It's uh, me and Rick have been talking about back picking someone, and we finally had the opportunity to took advantage of it. Okay, so which was more impressive, two pickoffs, two pickoffs in the top of the second, or the homer in the bottom? Uh, I think I like the pickoffs better. <laughs> All right, thanks a lot, Jacob. Appreciate it.